So these little eye operations are dramatically changed by these robots. To you, it's amazing to watch when these things sort of disappear in there and reappear when they're ready with an order. What do you see when you see the robots? How is this changing your operation most? Well, we've been doing fulfillment for 20 years and improving every year. This is a, a step function improvement to our last type of building. When you think about the challenge we face, it's all about this massive selection we carry. This site we're in today has over three and a half million units of unique selection, over 21 and a half million units of total inventory. And walking that selection to find product for the exact thing the customer wanted to shipment used to take a lot of time. Wait, there, are, there are over 21 million items here? There are 21 million, over million, 21 million. Over three million types of items. Exactly. And, and it, it is fairly, it's fairly bewildering to watch like children's toys and power drills and, and I don't know. You, you name it, everything. You know, everything from toys to vitamins to, you know, toy rockets. You know, I, my family and I have two sons. We, we probably do 90% of our shopping at Amazon between fresh and what I, you can buy I in the center. I assume boxes are going to my house right now, actually, because I live closer. But let me, let me ask you a question. You know, does the stowing and picking method, is it as effective in, with the robots? Does that change the way it works? Uh, it, it fundamentally changes it because it eliminates the walk. What you see now is everything we're doing is just a value-added element to the customer. It's putting the product in available for sale. This stuff is available right now for same-day delivery into San Francisco. Order it by noon, get it tonight. And the same thing on the pick side. When the product's delivered to the picker, it's just immediately there. They're available to go. It's on the way out. So where we were previously processing orders in an hour to an hour and a half, where our fastest cycle times are now down to as, as little as under 15 minutes. It's amazing. So you also, um, you've been at this for about six months. I've got to imagine there's a tremendous amount of learning that you guys are going through with this in terms of figuring out, oh, you know, that's going to actually help us with what? Like, what areas are you learning the most about this? There's, there's three big pieces here with this system. One is capacity expansion. It's all about getting more product, more selection available locally for customers into the same footprint. So in this building right now, we're getting 50% more product per square foot of space than we were in our previous generation. Now, is it simply a function of the, of the catacombs essentially don't have to be reachable? That's it's not like a library exactly. stack anymore? So because of the key, the system doesn't need pick aisles or walkways for people, and you don't need the intermediate uh, material handling systems, you get a lot more density of storage. As you can see back there, there's very few uh, open aisles. It's higher as well. Uh, you can't see. So most of your pickers aren't six foot five, although... <laughs> Well, if the we CV have, thing doesn't yeah, work out, exactly. I might call you soon. Well, you're always welcome. It's good to know. <laughs> so talk about the, the, the location of this facility. It's very interesting right. to me that it's, you know, an hour or two from San Francisco, from San Jose, from Sacramento. Mm -hmm. How do you cite the locations, and how is it the change in Amazon's sort of tax policy uh, aided that? Well, they we're all about getting closer to customers. And so, as I said, the first benefit here is all about getting more selection closer to customers. Then it's about speed of processing that you get with Kiva and our ability to fast, faster process for delivery to those customers. As we scale the network, as you move from one building to many buildings, you're able to get much closer to customers. So when you have five buildings, like we did back in 1999, you are more of a regional fulfillment player. We now have 50 buildings in the U.S., 109 globally, and with that footprint, we're able to now be much closer uh, to the, the urban locations where customers are located. And the impact of, of same-day delivery and Sunday delivery, I was, I was shocked a few weeks ago. I walked out of church and a, ma a mail truck went by. I thought, wait a minute, it's Sunday. And, of course, it was chock full of, of Amazon packages. Well, it, it's amazing how fast customers have really adjusted and uh, loved the Sunday delivery that we're getting. We now have 19 sort centers across the United States uh, supporting Sunday delivery to thousands of cities. That's a tremendous benefit of being part of our, our prime program uh, in true seven-day delivery. Is the job of pickers and stowers, final question, is it better or worse for them working with the robots? I mean, if, they're, if their productivity's got to be so much higher, are they working so much harder? Or is it better because they don't have to walk 10 or 12 miles a day? Well, I would encourage you to talk to them. I think what you'll find is the pickers and stowers really enjoy working with the system because what they're getting to do now is much more of the direct piece that customers appreciate. All our employees are owners in the company, and as owners in the company, they know what c customers value in terms of selection speed and, and price. And they know now that what they're doing is all directly related to what customers want, either making selection available faster or picking an order faster. And I think they really, the feedback has been super positive on this. Maybe their, their, their job satisfaction is better because they're getting to think more and walk less? Well, they're know. certainly getting to do, deal with a new level of technology. Uh, they're getting to deal with a new system, uh, and they're getting, you know, their customers are seeing the direct benefit from it.